the Indian. Then against England, you turned in a magnificent performance in the 77-78 season. It was a fantastic match because it was the first time New Zealand had beaten England in 48 matches. And that went way back to 1929-30. And it was your bag of 10. A very historical match for New Zealand cricket and for me personally. In fact, Geoffrey Boycott captained uh, England at that time. Uh, unfortunately for Mike Brady, he broke a hand, I think it was, in Australia. So Boycott had the, uh, the honour of leading England, which I guess he's always wanted to do. And I think he was the first losing, certainly the first losing uh, English captain against New Zealand. But quite a uh, historical match in the sense that uh, England only had to get 130-odd to win that particular match. And uh, because we'd blown out badly in our second innings, and I remember lying there after batting and not getting too many runs, rather frustrated and disappointing, uh, disappointing that, that I thought that uh, the game was over. And uh, as we walked down the steps onto the field, uh, the crowd were booing us, they were jeering us, they said, Oh, you've wasted an opportunity. New Zealand, New Zealand crowds, would you believe? And uh, there we have it. Uh, they didn't give us a lot of support. And Richard Collins and myself bowled flat out for two hours, that last two hour session. And we reduced England to something like 54 for 8 at stumps. And uh, next morning we mopped it up uh, pretty quickly, even though there's a little bit of rain that may have deprived us. But we got going again and bowled, uh, bowled them out, I think, for 64. That's exactly the delivery that Richard Hadley had to bowl to Root. Let's have a look at it again. Hadley bowling the ball. Up outside the off stump and Root not getting his feet into position, playing away, way from the body, getting the outside edge, and Warren Lee's taking a very fine catch behind the stumps in his right hand. And he's lifted that one and going to be out. <laughs> Old nine facing Richard Hadley with England six down for 53. He's confident appeal and he's gone. Yet another wicket for New Zealand. Hadley to Hendrick. What a fine, that's the one they wanted, Phil Edmonds, Richard Hadley pitching that ball up and Edmonds hanging the bat and the ball, a simple catch to John Parker at first slip. Well, it's not too pleased about all this, that he's being assaulted, well, sauce for the goose. Again a stab, he's gone, that's the wicket that's wanted. Taken by... The stumps are going right, left and centre. Well, that was the last test played at the Basin Reserve for quite some time. They did their redevelopment things then.